Hi guys, we're down to our last uh, game for January 8 game day for the NBA and this is uh, between Chicago Bulls and Los Angeles Lakers. Um, Chicago Bulls is actually number 10 in the East with 4 wins and 5 losses. They just came off a loss against the Sacramento Kings, 128-124. While the Los Angeles Lakers... They're number three in the West with six wins and three losses. The same with the Bulls. They're coming off a loss as well. Just tonight or just last night um, against the San Antonio Spurs. Um, the score was 118-109. So both teams coming off losses. And so, um, of course, both would want to get back to the winning track. All right. Moses. More especially Chicago, because you know they're below the 500% mark now. Okay, so what do we have here? Um, let's check on the injury list. Well, it shows here that KCP is ruled out. Is ruled as someone who is out for this game, and Alex Caruso always is still. Um, hmm, what's this? Okay, well. Alex Caruso is no longer in the injury list for uh, this game. I thought he is still, but yeah. He's no longer in the injury list for this game. That's good. That's good to hear. Now, for the Chicago Bulls, now this one sucks. They have five people who are listed and ruled as out for this game. Uh, of course, that's Dotson, RD, RD, I can't pronounce this ever right. RC Diakono, Satoransky. Hutchison and Mark Cannon. So um, that really is a huge sting for Chicago Bulls men, especially Mark Cannon and Satoransky. So, well, let's see as to when those people would uh, come back for the Chicago Bulls because as soon as um, they are able to play, for sure, that would give a positive impact towards Chicago. So um, this one would be held in... Uh, this one would be held, yeah. This one would be in Lakers' home. This one would be in uh, Staples Arena, the Staples Center. Um, this is 10 o'clock Eastern Time, so that's 11 o'clock a.m. Manila. Obviously, this would uh, th obviously Lakers is expected to win this one. Um, I know there are some of you guys who might be thinking that, but fatigue might kick in. And yes, you are correct. LeBron is LeBron. Uh, Anthony Davis is Anthony Davis, but. They get tired, right? Yep, that is correct. But um, the team that they're going up against is Chicago Bulls. Um, no disrespect to Chicago Bulls, but they even lack players, man. Uh, I just read five names of players who are out. So um, if ever there's someone tired on this, that's Chicago Bulls, man. Especially their starting, starting lineup. Um, uh, with those people out, you know, they've been playing hard minutes each and every night that they play so um i don't think the lakers would really have a problem in terms of fatigue especially they would want to win because they lost that game against the spurs if you're the los angeles lakers you gotta have a lot of pride you know you're the defending champions you don't want to go and fall back-to-back -back losses especially against a team like chicago so i'm expecting lakers to win this one um i'm checking on the spread it's actually minus eight Los Angeles Lakers and plus eight Chicago Bulls. Um, I also don't see any problem but, uh, for the Lakers to cover this. I know they lost by nine uh, last night. Talking about the Lakers, but again, that was the Spurs. We're talking about Chicago right now. And as always, if you um, if the if the champion lost previously, man, you are in a bad situation if you're going up against them because for sure vengeance is at their mind and you would be <laughs> you would be in deep trouble man um so I, I would love chicago to have a good fight but i really think that the lakers would be able to control this game uh, maybe they would be able to control the minutes of uh, lebron and anthony davis and all that but um at the end of the game minus eight for the lakers uh, should be very doable for them. Okay, so my call on this would be drop the money line and pick Los Angeles Lakers minus eight. 
Okay? Now, thank you for those who have already supported and subscribed to our channel. For those who still haven't, uh, please do. Uh, please click on the subscribe button and include the bell logo right there. Also, I placed a, a button on our YouTube channel. Just click on that. It says message me. It will bring you to our Facebook page. Um, and just follow and like that Facebook page. You would see the links, the videos that we have already posted here in Facebook. At the same time, you would be given access to our Messenger account so that you can send me questions or you can send me messages and whatever. I promise that I would be responding as soon as I am available and as soon as I am not sleeping. <laughs> um, so there. Um, again, thank you very much for those who are supporting and uh, I'm going to do my best to uh, give you the predictions um, as, far as, I, as far as I know. Um, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do my best, again, each and every day that I could. All right? If ever my predictions are a bit late, I apologize. It may be a case of me being out, being out of town, or maybe I'm just busy at work. All right? Again, thank you guys, everyone. Peace out. Pass a love and God.